HIV AIDS, Hepatitis B and Hepatitis C are three dangerous infections that are spread from one person to another in a similar way. Many people in the world get infected with these dangerous viruses and they don't even know about it. Here are some common ways how these infections spread from one person to another and tips for you to stay safe. The most common way of spread is by sharing needles. The virus from the infected person sticks to the needle and then can enter the body of the next person. Similarly, the virus can also spread from one person to another if you are sharing items of personal hygiene like razor blades and toothbrushes. It can also spread if the equipment used for surgeries, dental care, acupuncture and tattoos are not cleaned and sterilized properly between patients. So never share needles with anyone. Avoid injections and drips when you can take a pill. And if you have to get an injection, then make sure that the needle is new and it's disposed of properly after use. Do not share items of personal hygiene with others like razor blades, trimmers, and toothbrush. When getting tattoos, ear piercing, circumcision, haircuts, go to places that use new and clean equipment. And if you're unsure about it, then take your own equipment with you. Another common way of spread of these viruses is through sexual contact. The risk is low between single male and female partners, but it's high between male and male partners or having multiple sexual partners. Practice safe sex methods to stop transmission of these infections. You can also catch the virus by contact of infected blood with open cuts in the skin. So if you are cleaning up any blood stains, make sure you take good precaution. Put on gloves or wear some shopping bags on your hands that do not let the blood to penetrate and touch your skin directly. Babies born to mothers who carry HIV, Hepatitis B and Hepatitis C can also get infected with this infection. And many times the mothers might not even know that they are carrying these viruses. So it's very important to get tested for the mother and for the children after birth and seek appropriate treatment for it. We have a very effective vaccine to protect against hepatitis B. Every person should get this vaccine. Currently, we do not have vaccines for HIV or hepatitis C for protection, but we do have really good treatments for these diseases. So anyone who is at high risk or has been exposed to these viruses should get tested and get treated as soon as possible. The earlier you get started with treatment, the higher the chances of cure. By being informed, we can protect ourselves and the community around us from these dangerous infections. Spread this knowledge to others. Stay healthy and help others stay healthy.